Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trophin at the Babbling Belgian and welcome back to Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. We're back in the Fountainhead Palace because I'm going around every area we've been to to see if anything has changed since we killed that dragon creature and night has fallen on Ashina. So next up is over here because I think I can see I saw an item through the the grating here like right over there you can see an item yeah in that room somehow and I don't know how to reach that so I'm gonna assume that it's either through the roof or just some pathway down there that I missed I'm also gonna use one of those balloons because I've been carrying around a lot of those balloons I have 16 of those and I think these actually caused me to acquire more money for a period of time there we go we killed that one and I'm just gonna go through this rather quickly because I feel like we can if I just do this there we go ow 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 that was shock there we go jump over all his attacks and just heal up I can handle all of that I can handle all of that so it should be around here somewhere how do i get inside of here so maybe oh we never went in here right we saw that but we never went in here okay that's interesting let's go up and what is this so there's actually a few items here and even a chest Ooh, that's nice treasure carp scales treasure carp scales don't mind if I do. That's three more treasure carp skills. That means I can have whatever that pot noble was still selling. I think it was more of that leisure light. And the water of the palace. A cup filled with divine waters, a drink popular with nobles of the palace. When a wedding procession arrives at the fountainhead palace, this is the drink they are greeted with. The nectar of the palace nobles, go ahead, drink to your heart's content. Huh. Interesting. I have no idea what we can do with that. We had one in Mibu village that was drinking water. But I don't know if I need to give it to him or not. I want to go up. There we go. So that's that, I suppose. Because everybody else seemed to be dead. Although I could go through this a bit. I'm trying to take care of these guys. Okay. I'm an old man now. I'm an old man. Finally got hit with that once. Um. Hmm. This is interesting. Can't really do anything now. I'm gonna leave. Oh, there we go. Okay. Just gonna block that. There he goes. So when that happens, you turn into an old man. Don't want that to happen then. Oh, wow. No, no, don't stab me. He stabbed me in the heart, you dick. There we go. Backstab. And there that guy goes. Okay, aside from becoming an old man, this was actually part fine. So I don't think I missed anything here. So this was the area that the the flower bowl was guarding. I don't think I missed anything here. But I never checked out the rest of the rooftop, so maybe I did miss something. You know what? I'm actually going to go on a rampage now and just use another balloon. Because there's plenty of those nobles inside of there. There we go. So let's just do this. Kill this guy. And get his, uh, his item because we never took that because of the... Uh... Ah, it's just Grave Wax. Fine. That's one. That's another one. So I think it gives us 50% more stuff. There we go. 
Is that going to give us my resurrections back? No, because for some reason my resurrections don't come back. There we go. Couldn't see a single thing, but there we go. I don't know why my resurrections aren't coming back. Probably because of the fact that I became an old man once. But this guy really doesn't care. God damn you. So I'm actually scared of even going in now. Although there's nobody left here, so... Fine, we're fine. So this... Drops off into the... Guardian Apes watering hole, which is really a really cool detail. But I feel like I haven't really missed anything else here. Because there's not much here. And I think we have enough uh, enough money right now. That's 4,000 sen, which is nice. Uh, might want to spend some of those. And then we'll head to Mibu Village to see if anything has changed over there. Okay, so back in Mibu Village. We have this Memorial Mob guy here. So we can buy some stuff from him, probably. Uh, he has the fine confetti and he has bulging coin purses and scrap iron. So I think I'm going to go for about 10 scrap iron. And then buy the two bulging point coin purses with the rest. That should be fine. May the yes, yes. May the departed rest in peace. So now, I need to go through this area a bit again. As long as I'm not getting attacked, I'm fine, actually. Well, I am getting attacked, but I mean... <laughs> just want to check out one of these houses. I think it's this one? I'm not entirely sure. Okay. Okay. Is he mad at me now? Ooh. Okay. That changed. I was going to give him some, uh, some of the water, but let's kill this guy then. Okay, that wasn't happy, but we do still have that priest that was giving out the water. Because this guy, yeah, he couldn't resist the water, so he just went with it anyway. And I think, is it the house next to it? Because there was a hole on the other side here, yeah. This? Probably not. I think it's a bit further in the area, so give me a second. So this is where we fought Orin of the Water. She seems to still be gone. Which is good. Don't want to refight bosses at this point. Uh, hello? Okay, okay then. Okay. okay, I didn't think he was gonna do the attack because he like didn't move. There we go. Bury the ghosts. I don't get any money from this guy either. So more ghosts. It looks like the corrupted monk. So it was underneath here. I could go up one of those flippy doors. There we go. Flippy door. Still don't know how that works. But this guy. This guy. I have the real water for you now. Oh, please. Please. Accept us as your humble servants. There we go. Give water of the palace. Hello. Take this. Oh, this fragrance. Such an esteemed aroma. Finally, we may be accepted. We may serve as their humble servants. At last, at long last, you let me give you this. He wasn't a good man, though. So, Dragon Spring Sake. In that case, you will surrender it to me. Okay. That didn't sound friendly. That definitely didn't sound friendly. Okay, so he's gonna keep drinking now. Um, so that's that. We got some more Dragon Spring Sake from him. Which is probably key in getting all the conversation options. And I must have not gotten them all. 
uh, with the sculptor, which is why uh, Sekiro didn't recognize him during the boss fight last time around, but I'm not 100% sure. Uh, could be because of something else. And I feel like that's probably the the reason why we didn't get that. But quickly, now that we're here, quickly want to check out the Corrupt Monk's Arena as well, if anything has changed here. Because we killed the original Corrupted Monk, the real Corrupted Monk. But everything over here seems to be quiet. So let's take one final look at the Wedding Cave. And if there's nothing there, then we'll just try to get back into Ashina Castle for the third time again. Doesn't seem to be anything here. So the last thing I actually wanted to check, because there was one last thing on my list that feels like something had to happen there, but didn't happen. We, when we were going down in the Ashina depths, there was one cave that was really, really big. But for some reason, there was nothing to do there. So I'm wondering, I think it was... That cave? Riven cave? Or Riven cave? We'll see. Because the only thing I feel like we're still missing, and that we know that should be a thing, is there was a second war after we killed the guardian ape, but we never fought a second monkey. And I have no idea if I'm going the right way, because this is just the start of the Bodhisattva Valley. Bodhisattva Valley. Yeah, there he is. Yeah, so this is not gonna... So this is not gonna lead anywhere. On the other hand, I still don't know what to do with the... The serpent hearts. So we've done that. We've killed both of the snakes, but... I don't know what to do with the hearts. So this is not the, the place I was talking about. So my other idea would be that it's over here. When we were in the sunken valley, there was this... Oh, wait. This is new, I think. Who or what did this to you? Large ape. Oh, for fuck's sake. My neck. Large ape. Okay. Um, does that mean there's a second guardian ape? Oh, yeah. This was the ca cave. And there's the monkey. There, there's definitely the monkey. Um, I'm gonna have to change my, okay, so firecrackers, and then maybe, I don't know, what do you use against those? Uh, whilst enraging beasts, making them unable to distinguish friend from foe. That sounds good, right? Oh god. And I need to equip antidote powder instead, there we go. Okay. So, that's the headless one. Wait, wait a second. We killed this thing. Oh, for fuck's sake, and he has to. Come on. You can go suck a knob. And there we go again. Yeah. It seems like the same fight. I'll, I'll do a lot of damage too. So I'm gonna... Oh, I can't use the crackers, right. I don't know if the whistle's gonna do anything. It's not doing anything. Oh, that was another... Wait, what was that? I thought I heard extra screaming, but apparently not. Oh god. Ow. Drink. Sekiro, drink. There we go. That's the first one. This is going smooth. Ow. Oh, what the fuck? No! No, there is a second monkey! This is bullshit! This is bullshit! This is bullshit! No, the, the whistle's not doing anything! 
Oh, this is gonna gonna be gonna be annoying. Oh, this is annoying. Do I focus on the? Oh, come on. I stunned one, but I can't stun the other one. I do a lot of damage, apparently. So I'm wondering if I can just do this. Because it does do a lot of damage. Oh, I have no spirit emblems anymore. Okay. I am deflecting, but... Probably because of the direction being off. And I'm dead. Oh yeah, I'm in between. I can shake it now. There it goes. Oh, too greedy, too greedy. Gonna have to go to the sides. Come on, jump at me or something. That was something. The cave is rather big, but... Ah, oh, the other one is almost down. Get over here. Oh, come on. I almost have it. I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it. There we go. In the face, I got my resurrections back. Okay, so now it's just mano y mano. Okay, so that's a stun as well. Kind of forgot about that. I need to get my horseshoe back. Nope. There we go. Oh! Yeah, yeah, I got him. I got his number. I got his number. You're not gonna win from a Master Shinobi with a sword, monkey. That's the head again. Ah, oh, he's almost down. There we go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Let's pull that out again. Can you use the mortal blade this time? No, nope, no, he's not going to. Can, can we... There we go. Come on, mortal bladed in the face. <laughs> there was a third action. There was a third action, assholes. Headless ape, the headless guardian ape was a colossal beast. Plagued with the power of the undying. I think I've read that already. I we got another prayer beat, and now I have five. Ah, that's why I have five, because I got two. Immortality Sever. There we go. Guardian Ape Immortali Immortality removed. Bestowal Ninjutsu. And there we go. All ninjutsu techniques acquired as well. Ninjutsu technique that reads a blade in the victim's blood, extending its reach. Ooh. Cross Spirit Emblem. Spirit emblems to use activated after a backstab that blow. The wolf discovered this technique upon beheading a foe with a mortal blade, forming a cursed sword from spilled blood. 
Though it bears likeness to the mortal blade, it cannot kill the undying. Okay. That's a lot of stuff. Stop moving. Stop moving, little worm. He's still moving. He's still moving. So we killed the second ape. Wow, okay, didn't expect that, but uh, one shot boss fight. One shot boss fight, there we go. Sculpt this idol found. That's a new one, yeah. Let's do three things, enhance attack power. There we go. Anything new? At one time, the guardian ape shared its den with a mate, but he alone became infested while the other passed away. Now even the flowers offered in tribute to her passing have withered to dust. So he was guarding, the, originally he was guarding that white flower to lure in a mate, a new mate. And apparently it worked, after he got resurrected from me killing him the first time. Then enhance her physical attributes. There we go. An unrivaled sumo wrestler once served the great feudal lord. Dismissed after giving to drink, he fell to a life of brigandry. And so he was dubbed Chuzo the Drunkard. So that's the first drunken guy we fought at the very beginning in Hirata's uh, estate. There we go. And then the third thing we're going to do is acquire some skills. Skills to pay the bills. Uh, we could go with Living Force. Allows one to perform a follow-up attack with certain tools that imbues the sword with the tool's effect. That's going to be incredibly useful. But we need four skill points to even do that. It's for some reason only works with flame bent and divine abduction. After gathering vortex, I would think that would work with the umbrella as well. I, I've said that a few times, but I only can do one follow up attack with the umbrella. And now for our daily mandatory trip to the Hirata estate and our uh, friend Harunaga. More skills. There we go. Let's purchase the lapis lazuli. Lazuli. You can buy that, that's for six, and then the dragon's broad droplet for one. And then we have bought everything again. Okay. Does that mean you're done? I can't give you more scales. I literally can't. Because oh no, you have two charges of lapis lazuli. That's gonna be okay. Okay, too small. Still too small. Okay, moving back to uh Ashina Castle this time. Now, come to think about it, what can we actually give... Who can we actually give the hearts to? I think a doctor might be fine, right? I'm actually gonna keep... Ooh, Mask Fragment Dragon. Kinda forgot about that thing. Still 5,000 coins, might as well do that. So I think I have 500 now. That's 3,000. And now two of my bulging coin purses, I will get to 5,000. Care to purchase. Yes, we care. We care to purchase an offering. There we go, Mask Fragment Dragon. And there we go. I think that's the last piece we were missing. If I'm correct about this. And then we might just buy another pallet with the rest of our money. Just to not lose anything. Dancing Dragon Mask. A dragon's head dancing mask made whole by piecing the fragments back together. Grants the ability to exchange skill points for attack power in the Sculptor's Idol menu. The Okami warrior women would wear this to the Fountainhead's palace. There, they would dance as an offering for the dragon. Mysteriously, the ritual left them brimming with vigor. Ooh. So now I can just... Use my skill points directly as attack power, or... That's gonna be... Overpowered. How many do I need? No. But... That is cool. So I can enhance my attack power with skill points. Cool. So that's a way to keep leveling up even after you've, well, leveled up fully. Quickly gonna go to the doctor. Because I feel like he might know what to do with the hearts. I'm just gonna take care of the bugs. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do, but there we go. Made him a puppet. This is my this is my friend. Uh, this is Mike. Mike is uh, he's he's a nice guy usually. Um, I'm gonna actually equip my new ninjutsu, the bestowal. Yeah, the bestowal seven spirit emblems. Holy crap! So, Mike, what are you doing over the weekend? 
Anything good? Just hang around with your dead buddies? Okay, fine. Could I have gone over here before? So I feel like that would have been nice to know. I've never seen this. The doctor is still there. But I never gave him a fresh corpse, which is going to be a problem. Because I feel like there was only one option, and it was that guy that eventually died because of the shamanism play. The details are in the dark. Considering the nature of the information. So, yeah. We still need to... Okay, thank you. Th thank you. I think Mike died permanently. So, okay, we can't give him the hearts. But I feel like the hearts would have gone to him if we... Would have given him a live person. Which is interesting. So we're going to do the same trick to get back into Ashina Castle as before. No. 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 I have no idea how to get back there then. Um, hmm. How do we get... Is it through Kuro's room and I just missed how we get out? Okay, so Ishin is still dead. He's still dead. I still can't go up here probably. Because this doesn't go anywhere. Okay, sorry. So that one doesn't do anything either. And... Okay, yeah, so I could have gone over here. I was wondering about that. About that item we quote-unquote missed. But... Lord Kuro escaped the castle through the secret passage. The secret passage can be found along the moat in the Ashina Reservoir. Not far from the Moonview Tower. He is waiting for you in the silver grass field. The Nightjar have left smoke signals on the roofs under Lord Ishin's orders. The smoke should lead the way to Lord Kuro. Well, well all fine and good, but, but you know, th there's no way out of this place anymore. Forgive me, but now's not a time for libations. I could have tried. Uh, I think I don't have any gourd seeds yet. Please. Okay. Go to Lord Q... Oh, yeah. Should have probably not missed this giant opening. Um, smoke signals. Smoke signals. Well, while we're still here. While we're still here, we could just do that. Just want to check. That was a weird noise. Wait, what? Okay, so there's spewing fire all over the place. They're doing fine. Look, the soldiers are doing, they're doing fine, aren't they? But no, they're dying. Yeah, they're definitely dying. I'm just wondering. No, that top area is completely locked off now. That is interesting. There are items strewn about, though. Because this is supposed to be Ishin's tower, right? So what have they done over here? Oh, wait a second. Was this something I could have opened? All the time already. The Black Scroll. An old text describing a black mortal blade. In addition to the red mortal blade, there exists one that is black in color. The blade's name is Open Gate and is said to hold the power to open a gate to the underworld. It is through this power that it creates life. I beseech you make offerings for the dragon's blood. Wait, I know where that is. Because there's... There's actually a shrine to the dragon's blood down here somewhere. But well, the music is going, although I should have been fighting, but I'm not. Um, what? What? Ashina Elite. Is he here? There he is! Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's a pallet. That's not good. Eat shit, buddy. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, can I actually uh, access the menu real quickly? Because I feel this guy is, has red eyes, so if I... Okinaga's flame bent. Swap over to it. That's that. This guy is ridiculous. Although I feel like he only does one attack. Let's try that again. 
Oh wait, I can eavesdrop on this guy. Lordy Hing. I will be borrowing this. Please watch over me. We, the Ashina clan, will win this battle. Okay. Okay, he saw me. Okay. Get over here, buddy. I just want to heal up the full. Whew. This guy is quick. Oh ha 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 ha! You fucking dick! He just got what the flicking crap? <laughs> yeah, that's gonna hurt. So can I get over here? Yeah, I can. So this is a different sculptor's idol, but I'm wondering if this allows me to get. I'm just gonna commune with it again because I need to find it again, which is ridiculous. But sneak. Then, so these swords guys are still here. Which is not too bad, because I think I can handle them. There we go. Doesn't seem to be too many of them here. And they're screaming already, so they're fighting each other. So I want to see that if I move in from the other side, which is supposed to be down here, if I recall correctly. So like this. It's in this area. There he is. So if I can sneak up completely, then I can get a death blow in beforehand. Getting a death blow in beforehand... No. Okay, I can't. I can't. And I think I need to go through his posture bar if I want to... There we go. So I can get to... There we go. Okay, so I need to quickly deflect this guy. Yeah, okay, so don't do that. Get out of the way. I'm not healed to full. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Come on, get that back. No. There we go. Woo! Jesus, Mina. So you need to parry him twice in quick succession to get him down. Woo! All my healing gourds done, but uh, that got me a bit uh, of leeway. Okay, okay. We got this, we got this. Just gonna head back to the sculptor's idol way quickly. Although I do want to check if there's anything new up the stairs now that we're here. So if we go, oh, okay. There's more noise up here. We might be fighting in the dojo, but this is also a sculptor's idol. Are they fighting in here? There's definitely somebody here, but just gonna grab this. And rest. And we get our third resurrection node back again. There we go. So one Ashina swords. Well, not Ashina, because this is probably the central forces, dude. Because they're fighting the Ashina guys. Oh, 
Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Seriously. Jesus Christ. Ow, 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 ow. Ah, they killed me. So that guy in the corner is annoying. There we go. I'm gonna use that special blade. I wanna see what, what that does. <laughs> I think it's a bit overpowered. It just eats through his defenses. There we go. <laughs> Goodbye. Well, that was interesting. That, that was interesting. Holy shit, that blade is powerful. If you can get that blood blade on, that is ridiculous. That just went through his defenses. I damaged him every time I hit his face. Even if he blocked it, I just got extra damage from it. That was interesting. There's nothing over here, and there's nothing over here. No, nothing at all. So there's more smoke where this came from. I must have been able to get in here as well. Maybe that window has been opened up. That was an interesting boss fight, and this probably hasn't changed. Yeah, what happened to Genichiro, by the way? Because he's still alive, isn't he? He's still lurking somewhere with his... Uh, with this Tomoe woman. Um, but with that done, I think I did about three boss fights in this episode. So I think I think I'm gonna take a little break. So with oh yeah, okay, this guy resurrected. Never mind. I'm gonna rest again. I'm gonna rest again. Rest, rest. There we go. Bye. Bye. Okay. <laughs> kind of forgot about that one. So, thank you guys enormously for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode of Sekiro Shadows Eye Twice. Thanks for watching and goodbye.